Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. Garrus loyal, reasonably intelligent, but aggressive, almost like Krogan. For the third time, Doctor, I'm not interested. Ah, Shepard. We were just... Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful. Or put any faith in Solarian doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? Kind that ends the genophage. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive. Also affecting comfort of patient. He was your inside source, Rex. You can trust him. Solarians have minds like a maze. You never know when they're leading you into a trap. Trap? Eve's release my doing. Would never have known about her if not for me. That was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility, her welfare a priority. Will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> you got a quad, Doctor. Keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Don't forget, still need your tissue sample. I'll be back. Common phobia. Fear of needles. Or Solarian doctors. Now have work to do. Prefer females of the species. Maybe with an inhibitor. No, 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 no. Entire catalyzing process would fail. Severe neurological damage. Never mind. What are you talking about? Method to extract functional cure without killing you. Many variables. Your immune system compromised. Considering options. And you have to do it out loud? Yes. Auditory learner. Need to hear self think. Simulate conversation to promote new ideas. Maximize productivity. But you're talking about me dying. Oh, apologies. Medical details causing emotional distress. I hadn't considered effect on patient. No, it just means I can't sleep. Doing my best to keep you alive will avoid... Sensitive subjects. Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. We owe a lot to you, even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. I feel bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered it the day I became a shaman of the female clan. I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. I didn't realize the Krogan had female shamans. Wisdom comes from pain, and the genophage has made us very wise. Rather than surrender to despair, a few of us chose to preserve the ancient ways. We safeguard our culture, our knowledge, our secrets. So when our children live again, the Krogan will flourish. How were you initiated? You're locked in a cave for seven days with just enough food to last. On the eighth, you'll starve. What does that prove? Your resolve. Every acolyte is given a chance. You either claw your way out through the rock with your bare hands, or you die. How did you make it out alive? I started digging the wrong way. I was in complete darkness. Nothing other than my own heartbeat to sustain me. What happened? I found this. A simple crystal, but it became my chisel. Take it as a reminder, Commander. In the darkest hour, there is always a way out. It's a brutal initiation. But an illuminating one. You learn to appreciate the light by living in the dark. If you don't mind me asking, what's it been like living with the genophage? I knew sisters who couldn't bear the shame of being infertile. They would wander off into the wastelands, hoping a thresher maw would kill them and end their torment. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Yes. After my first stillborn. What kept you from ending your own life? When my child didn't draw breath, that's when my life truly began. The genophage forces us to live on hope alone. There is nothing else. 
there is no reason to exist other than the hope that the next day will bring change. And if it doesn't, there is always the next. How do you think things will change after the genophage is cured? Our species will find its balance again. Females will help shape the future, like in the ancient days, before we were just pawns of power-hungry males. <laughs> Most seem hell-bent on shooting anything that looks at them wrong. What else is there for them to do? Because of the genophage, they become wandering killers, seeking targets to justify their existence, excuses to earn them honor. What do you think of Rex? When he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong leader. I know in his heart Rex wants what's best for us. Though not all the other clans see it that way. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And that you can tell him. Do you think Rex will want revenge for the genophage? Some clans will expect it, but I hope Rex resists. He understands the cycle of violence must end if Krogan are ever to have a voice in galactic politics. Still, he's just one Krogan. If enough clans demand it, he may not be able to stop them. How'd you get involved in Malin's experiments? The other females and I volunteered. We heard Malin was trying to cure the genophage for Clan Werelock. Aren't they a rival clan? Rivalries are the invention of the males. Under their rule, Tachanka has laid in ruins for over a thousand years. It's time females took back our place in society and resurrected our future. Malin was our best hope. I found Malon's lab. It looked like a dungeon. His experiments were brutal. We learned that too late. He meant well, but his methods grew more barbaric as he went. We finally escaped into the rubble. Eventually, a Salarian team found us. They saved our lives. We were so sick. I'm sorry none of the other females survived. I know. The youngest one, Kern, was the last to go. But she knew she would enter the void free of this curse, and then smile when she looked down upon the children of Tachanka. Her spirit will be the midwife to my firstborn. Would you go to Malon again? Absolutely. It only takes one candle to light a fire, and then the darkness is no more. How has Morden been treating you? Better than Krogan males do. He's not like a typical Salarian. No, no, no. Organ redundancy results in new period before metaphase. Can't alter that. Damage to telomeres, premature aging. He does that. But I sense pain in him, too. He told me about his work on the genophage. I should consider him an enemy. Yet I think seeing my sisters and I changed something in him. A sorry Borcha offspring have an allergy to dairy and... Well, it wasn't his ear. Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. I'm glad to see humans treat their women with respect. Your people have placed a lot of responsibility on you. No more than your people have put on you. <laughs> then maybe we can show the men how it's done. <laughs> Deal. Something else, Commander? Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. Shepard, blood work complete. Indicates significant stress on Eve's system. Malin's data thorough. Fortunately detailed as well. Have used notes to improve her condition. How's she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure? My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her. My patient. My responsibility. Found her at STG base. 
Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. You always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turians doomed without Progan support. Progan need unified threat. Outlet for aggression. Cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left. But still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Possibly. Stakes too high for inexperience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right. To prove I can. So we did the right thing by saving the data? Indeed. Would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tachanka? Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. Any word on Malin himself? No. Ordered teams to search for him when trying to help Eve. Nothing so far. Large galaxy. Lots of places to hide. Could already be dead for all we know. Would kill him now, if possible. Unless he could help. So the end justifies the means. Not my means. But you're using the data. Encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. Will always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can help Eve. Can cure genophage. Won't ignore data vital to her survival because of unethical origins. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity, totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect. Health trouble. You think you can make this work for all, Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well, tune hormone production, long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. Nice talking with you, Morden. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure, work against collectors, decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny, sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. <laughs> you go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. Shepard, how can I help? Nice talking with you, Morden. We'll be here if you need me. Vaguely. Years ago, I worked with a man named Armistan Baines. I thought he was with the Alliance, but found out later he was a Cerberus agent. I shudder to think how long Cerberus has planted covert operatives on the Citadel. Everything okay in the med bay? I believe so. I can tell Martin needs some space. If a medical emergency comes up, I'll be there. For now, I'll stay out of his air, or horns, or whatever those pokey things are called. Hello, Commander. Commander?
Commander.